The bullet blender is a great tool for lysing cultured cells. This process can be carried out in any model bullet blender, but in this movie we're going to use the BBY24M, or the bullet blender storm, which homogenizes samples in microcentrifuge tubes. I'll be using yeast cells as an example, but the guidelines presented here can be applied to any type of cell culture. First, harvest your cells and spin them down to yield a pellet. If you're homogenizing your cells in 1.5 milliliter microcentrifuge tubes, we recommend that the volume of your pellet be no larger than 300 microliters. Next, add a volume of beads equal to the volume of your pellet. For yeast, I'm adding 0.5 millimeter zirconium oxide beads. To get bead recommendations for other types of cells, please check out the protocols on our website, www.nextadvance.com, or contact us at support at nextadvance.com. Finally, add a volume of buffer or reagent that is twice the volume of beads that you're using. Now, completely close the caps of your tubes and place them evenly spaced inside of the bullet blender. I have eight samples loaded. I'm going to set the speed to 8 and the time to 3 minutes, close the lid and press start. Examine your samples. If homogenization appears to be incomplete, or if your results show that cell lysis is unsatisfactory, place them back in the bullet blender and homogenize for another minute or two at speed 10. Now it's time to proceed with your downstream application.